good morning things abians uh, today wednesday august 11th let us welcome another uh, wonderful day with high investment spirits as we always do a uh, few uh, things abians have uh, asked questions regarding uh, if i miss the initial entry the alert how do i get back to it if and the second one is how did uh, we have the highest conviction on uxin where i am investing significantly so let us address both of them so the first one uh, if i miss the uh, the alert um how do i get back to it so in my opinion again these are all my thoughts i am not certified financial advisor so consider all these as uh, opinions not as an advices so if i miss the initial uh, alert i will look back and see what is this stock and who are uh, into this stock which institutions invested into it and what is the value or what is the current market uh, looking into this product and services so to go back to this yuxin example as i explained many times so the very uh, the most important factors that i looked into is the institutions gic private limited warburg pincus and bailey gifford and uh, renaissance technologies and wells fargo um all these big institutions have invested into it and uh, they invested very significantly into this the second most important factor is uh, the business itself it's a used car selling business and we already seen the power of carvana so these two things have concluded me that uh, this will be an, an this will be a very good uh, you know opportunity to invest here we have seen the power of carvana of course it takes time but i believed that this stock has good potential as uh, carvana has so uh, the coming back to that uh, the alert and missing the alert how do i get back is just uh, look into it see if i can uh, still invest here uh, based on the uh, product all right uh, yuxin if you take an example we i entered on april 16th when we got the sec 13d transaction from richway global limited so that day i entered it was $1.32 and within 4 or 5 days uh, we got another news from jd.com that they partnered with yuxin that's where i added again thinking that it has more potential and again within few days on april 27th we got another transaction from uh, gic private limited uh, where they increased their share their stake in yuxin so all these three things have uh, given me a mountain of confidence and ocean of courage really to see this as uh, you know unstoppable uh, um, you know growth trajectory so with that confidence we invested and of course the entry point always makes the difference so when we entered from $1.32 and now it is being 356 or 370 is already given uh, close to 100% returns or close to 90% returns so the entry point also makes the difference but again in another uh, account i i entered at uh, $3.15 you know kind of range too so when you see a value or a you know product has a lot of potential i think taking uh, an entry at any given level is okay in my opinion again you have to have the patience and confidence and courage to see at what level you are entering and what's your objectives can you really wait so from 130 $1.32 it went all the way to 350 so from here it may take little time to go to the next level so you have to be prepared and do not set the uh, expectations too high because it takes time for any stock to take uh, take off we can't expect everything to go in overnight so be prepared for that and having uh, you know abundance of patience and ocean of confidence and mountain of courage always give us the results is what we have seen you know you look back all of the stocks that we picked any of them have done uh, incredible or phenomenal uh, returns uh, if you wait long enough here so that's uh, all i think of so let us welcome another uh, wonderful day uh, let's not worry about any of the market conditions don't get panic um, you know the stock market always uh, test our patience or will try to show its fluctuations in what not but we have to remain confident and positive and uh, just keep uh, moving forward thank you all have a good day